So to make this type of handle, you will need your beads, you need your fishing line, this is 0 0.7 mm. You need your scissors for cutting. You start by picking four beads. And then you cross the last one. this and the next you pick three one on the left one on the right you cross the third bead okay and then you repeat the step two twelve times okay so you pick three, one on the left thread, one on the right thread, and then you cross the last bead. I have four here, so I will continue till I have twelve. I have my twelve now. So I'm going to turn to make it thirteen, and then turn. You can either turn on the left thread or on the right thread, but here I'm going to turn on the left thread, and so I will pick three. But here I will. Put two beads on the left thread, okay, and then I will cross the last one with the right thread. You see that? Okay, so once again on my left thread, so now we are starting the second row. On my left thread, I will fix two beads on it. And then with the third bead, I will cross with my right thread. And then from here, I will enter the next bead with my right thread. And then pick two beads, one on the left and then cross the second bead with the right thread okay so this is what we are going to do to complete the second line you see that so you enter the next one bead you pick two one on the left and then you cross the second bead This is where I have gotten to, okay. So I will still enter the next bead with my right thread, and then on that same right thread, I will pick two beads, fix one on it, and then cross the second one with the left thread, okay. So our second line will be complete like this now to start start the third line third and final line on my right thread here i will pick three beads and fix two on it and then on the last one with the last one sorry i'll cross it with the third <laughs> the left thread you enter the next one bead you pick two So this is what we call the bead matting. It is very common because that if you understand this one, you can use it for almost every design. I am done with this one. Okay, so I have 13 by 3. So you have to do another one, which should be 33 long by 3. Okay. So this long one is going to be the semicircle shape here. And then the short one, this one, is for the down part here. Okay. But I am going to join this one first. To join on this top side of the thread, the top, the one in my left hand, I will fix one bead on it. Okay, 
and then on that same thread or with that same thread I will enter this first side bead here okay this one and then I'll pick one bead and cross it so that it will close up okay So next, I will enter the next bead on my right, the next one bead with the right thread. And then you enter the next bead on your left with the left thread, okay? And then you pick one bead and then you cross. So that is how we are going to close it up. So I'll enter the next bead on my right with the right thread. Enter the next bead on the left with my left thread. Pick one bead and cross. Okay. So I am done closing this up. What is left for us to do? is to join this to this so that we can close this one up for well, this side of the thread see that the two threads one is towards this side so the one that is up here this one i'll fix one bead on it okay like this enter this bead another bead and then cross it have you seen that okay so now with this side of the thread the one in my right palm so we want it to be like this okay so I will enter this one with my right thread And enter this middle bead here with the left thread okay and then you pick one bead you cross it hope you understood that and then next with my right thread I will enter this bead here like this and then with the left one, I will enter this bead, okay? So you pick one bead. You cross. Okay, so have you seen now with this side of the thread the one towards this one i'll use that thread to enter these two beads so that i can close this up okay have you seen that so now you continue with the closing method you enter the next bead on your left with your left fishing line the next bead on your right with your right fishing line you pick one bead and then you cross okay so just like how we joined it to this I'm going to be repeating the same thing so I pick one bead fix it on this thread and then with that same thread, I will enter this bead here. Okay. 
click one bead and then you press my threads have become very short but i'll try as much as possible to use it okay so now you enter this bead this very one for this side of the thread and then you do the same for the other side pick one you press okay so here I will enter this bead with this side of the thread and this very one with the other side of the thread okay You pick one, you cross. Okay, so here I will still enter the beads on each side. So this one and this one, okay. And since there is a bead here already, I will not pick another bead, but I will cross that bead with the threads. And then you can choose to tie a knot instead and then enter few beads with the rest of the thread and you will be all done. Okay, so this is how you can achieve this semicircle handles. Okay. okay, so thanks for watching. Bye bye.